Hi guys, welcome back to another plan with me, and this week I'm planning from December the 24th till December the 30th, also known as Christmas week. Now, you might already be able to tell, but Christmas is my favourite time of the year, and I cannot wait to get stuck into this plan with me. So, let's get stuck in straight away. This is my kit that I have chosen. It is from the Plump Planner. Now, if you watched the last week, you would have known that I had a slight hmm, planner sticker issue when it came to Christmas week. I was sorting through all my kits and I found out I didn't have a Christmas kit for Christmas week. And so I panicked a bit and I was like, oh, you know what? I'm just, just going to have to buy one. I cannot have a week bare in my own cauldron, especially Christmas week. So... There are the full boxes, washi tapes and glitter headers, got some check boxes here, some icons, and then we've got our weekend banner, little deco, and our half boxes there. So, I think without further ado, I'm going to get the washi down. Now, I am currently filming this a little earlier, I am filming it the Thursday before Christmas so however when you see this it will be Christmas Eve and my family has a few, a few traditions when it comes to Christmas Eve I think we look forward to Christmas Eve as much as most families look forward to Christmas Day and so Oh, done that slightly wonky. Just flatten that out a bit. There we go. So, washi is down straight away. That's awesome. Okay, so first job done. Right, next. I need to do... I think I'm going to do these uh, checkboxes first. So... You will see that I only have three checkboxes here. However, we do have quite a few extra glitter headers. So what I'm thinking of doing is perhaps turning some on this side like that. I might even do the gold so it'd be easier to see if I make my own like checkboxes with. So I'm just gonna I always do these ones on the weekend because the likelihood of me doing stuff on the weekend is a lot lower than during the week. So that can go there. Right, I just realised I've just jogged the camera. So let's get that straight again for you. There we go. Right, you should be able to see now. Okay, so, right, and before I forget, because I always seem to forget the weekend banner, I'm going to put this down as well at the bottom, like that, there we go, perfect, okay, check boxes, so I'm going to do one of these, miss one, Another one, miss one, and, and so on. Like that. Okay. Oh, that's a tricky bit. So yes, as I was saying, my family really looks forward to Christmas Eve. And... Because... I don't know, it's the relaxing time before Christmas begins. I mean, usually for us, we are cooking on Christmas Eve. However, this year, we won't need to do that. So, it's actually going to be really nice to be able just to relax. Um, however, we do have a couple of traditions. Uh, the tradition, the first tradition that we have is that we always have McDonald's for tea. 
It used to be Chinese. We always, always used to have Chinese takeaway. However, wait a minute before I carry on. Right, we've got two patterns on, so I'll probably do the black ones in the middle. Okay, let's carry on. Um, yes, we always have McDonald's for tea. And whilst we're eating tea, we always have, uh, we always watch, sorry, the same film every year, no matter what. And that is always Scrooge or The Christmas Carol, depending on whatever version you're watching. We usually watch the same, the same version every year, which is the Patrick Stewart version, which we got free from a Daily Mail once. And we've watched it ever, ever since. So, yes, there are two traditions. And we are starting a new tradition this year. By having a Christmas Eve box. So, this is something that my mum wanted to start. And it's awesome. You just be able, basically just get to have... Just treat, a box full of treats on Christmas Eve. Before the festivities begin on Christmas Day. I'm very much looking forward to starting that tradition this year. So, yes, that's going to be very, very fun. Do you have any traditions for, well, both Christmas Eve or Christmas Day? I'd love to hear them if you'd let me, do, let me know down bottom. Right, there we go. Headers, first sort of headers down. So it is, it's full box time. Now. Hmm, I am not sure which ones to do. I'm thinking of perhaps... See, I was thinking of having this one up there. But I forgot that this kit comes with a special box that has been designed size-wise specifically for it. So I might actually... Well, I'll probably use this box for what it's meant to be used for, I guess. So... There we go. That looks awesome, doesn't it? Which means ah, that I've now got to find out which ones I'm going to use. So I'll probably use this one for Christmas Day instead. So I'll pop that one down straight away. There we go. There we go, so that one's done. Right, next one. There isn't like any sort of patterns that we could try and go between, so I might just do it random. So, there we go. Oh wow. What was that? I think that was like the worst way I've ever put a sticker down. That was bad. Okay, let's try that again. Ah, oh, there we go. That's better. Okay, uh, let's do Christmas tree next. There we go. Then that one. I think I might leave this one just because it's probably the plainest out of all of them. And I won't be doing an awful lot this this week, so it's not like I need to worry about covering any full boxes up or anything. So yeah. Mm. Right, okay, this one next I think, and then I'll have Oh wait, or should I not do that one? Because that one is the same. Okay, right. Green fairy lights, you're in. You're in. Okay, there we go. And the last four box. Although that's going to be funny because it's going to look like one massive four box. Instead of it being a four box and a header. Okay, there we go. That looks a bit better, doesn't it? Oh, we're starting to feel very Christmassy. Oh, that's amazing. Right, next lot of headers. Which, yes, I'm, I've decided to use the 
black glittery ones and then we can have the other patterned ones up at the top like that okay so let's carry on with those I don't think we have any other Christmas traditions though not like I think of all top of my head I mean we always gather like my whole family always comes together on Christmas Day no matter what you know my grandparents live all the way in North Norfolk and which is quite a long way away from where I live However, no matter what, they still managed to come here or as you probably know from last plan with me, this year we're going up to theirs. So, yeah, it's, it's always a really magical time. Anyway, let's stop getting all very sentimental at Christmas. And, oh, I probably for forgot to do the top headers. Let's pop those back on. But you may, yes, you may already have Christmas editions, and I would love to hear what yours are. We used to do this tradition where every year we would, instead of having a normal roast dinner for Christmas lunch, we would go around the world and we would have dishes from you know, set menus from different countries around the world you know we've done Korea we did Chinese we've done Indian we've done Jamaican once so and that that was really fun I used to like doing that a lot um, so but this year we are having a normal roast dinner like I meant to, <laughs> I guess like I meant to Either way, it'll be fun and tasty, so. Oh, nearly done. One more day. There we go. I just can't believe how quickly Christmas has come around. It is it's truly insane how quickly it's come. So, I, I know that it says Christmas Day up here, but... I do want to do a little, I want to do a big half box and write it massive. Not just in case I forget, because there's no way I can forget it's Christmas. But, oh no, it's just, it means a lot to me, so that can have its own full box. Right, other things. I need a full box on Friday. Because my husband is getting paid and luckily this kit comes with a payday payday sticker so that's good and then Christmas Eve I will actually I'm gonna do this because this is a big thing for my family so that can have its own half box as well and I can write down there that we'll be watching Watching Scrooge slash a uh, Christmas Carol <laughs> um, whilst having McDonald's for tea. There we go. Right. So next thing. It's not quite a present, but it's an envelope, and uh, it will do, won't it? So that can go there. Then I'm going to write in here that we're going to have a very long trek, you know, to my grandparents. It's probably going to take us around three, three hours. It can take up to four, but being Christmas and everyone, anyone sensible isn't driving on Christmas. <laughs> so it should take us a little quicker than it usually does. Right, the next thing, I am going to put this down, 26, on the 26th Boxing Day start, uh, Boxing Day, 
and usually Boxing Day, Boxing Day sales start on Boxing Day all the way through uh, uh, and end whenever it feels like it, I guess. So that, that can go there for the Boxing Day sales. The next thing is that probably on the 27th there we go, we'll be doing some laundry. I will I have asked for clothes for Christmas. So no doubt I'll be wearing new clothes and basically going through my wardrobe, chucking out new stuff, cleaning the new clothes if they need to be washed before wearing all the very exciting stuff that happens after Christmas. Okay. So what other things do I know that's definitely happening? Mm. I am not sure what other than that because it's just one big it's just one massive great big fun filled week isn't it well there is something that I know we will probably be doing and that's because we're not at home this year we'll be missing all the Christmas day specials like Doctor Who Christmas special or Strictly Come Dancing a Christmas special and so no doubt we'll probably be catching up on those on the 26th I've just remembered as well we've said that on the 26th although you know Christmas is Christmas and we're having it with my grandparents we're going to be playing more games and spending Christmas at our house on the 26th you know in my family it is tradition to try and eke out celebrations whether it's birthdays or anniversaries or, or Christmas you know make it last as long as possible because we love having family all together so that's <laughs> that's our way and I think I'm probably gonna mark it with Christmas star just because it's festive and it's fun Okay, next thing, Monday, Christmas Eve, I will be washing my hair, having baths, all my family usually do it on Christmas Eve, so when we are all together on Christmas Day, you don't need to worry about that bit. And I think, other than that, that is all the main main stuff down. No, there is one thing I forgot and I always forget to do it but until the last minute. Thursday. Thursday is plan with me day. Day that I always film the week after and oh it's gonna be a new planner. I am very excited. I'll be getting my happy planner on Christmas day. Thank you, Mum, if you're watching this. <laughs> she is. She has very kindly bought me my new planner for next year, and I cannot wait to get stuck in. Oh, I'm very excited. You, you probably haven't guessed already. I really like Christmas. Okay, and what I will probably do, like I usually do, is just two half boxes here on the weekends because we always end up doing something. There's also another thing that we like to do around Christmas time. It's not a it's not a Christmas tradition, I guess, because it doesn't happen on the same day every year, like Christmas Day does. Um, and it's not something we follow religiously, I guess. Been a couple of years where we haven't done it, but there we go. You can see now. We usually go and see the Christmas lights in London and we haven't yet seen them this year. So if anything I guess Saturday or Sunday might be a day that we actually go out and see them because they don't get taken down until I think like the first week of January so that probably be a lovely way to round off 2018. Okay other than that Everything else, I think, is just going to be filled in as I get there. I have a couple of things to do later on in the week. Although I am off work, 
there are still some things I can I can be doing you know prep for when I go back so I'll probably end up doing doing that there um hmm I think I think that's gonna be it because oh no there is one thing I forgot to put down I'll do it in a quarter box because I haven't actually used any of these yet on Friday I do have a bill going out so I guess I can remind myself there <laughs> okay now other than that I think I will probably fill this in as I go it was one of my worries about Christmas week because it's just it's just eating isn't it eating and playing games for a whole week and you don't you can't just put that on every single day but meh what are you gonna do about it it's Christmas okay so next thing sidebar I love the plump planners new deluxe kits that she has brought out because they just include so many more stickers for such a little increase in price it is insane I think she has done an amazing job with the with the add-ons she calls them so there we go I'll do habit tracker as I usually do I'll pop my weekly to do box then put another habit tracker down and I'll probably just put a half box at the bottom wow that is super wonky there we go let's just fix that quick Oh, that's better. There we go. And the half box just for a highlight of the week, which, I mean, I could write it in now. It's clearly going to be Christmas, isn't it? There's no point planning, just in case I think of something different. It'd be Christmas, spending time with family. There we go. So I just have some couple, a couple of deco pieces left. I really like this one and I am so tempted to just to pop it up like here I'm also scared to waste that uh, white space just in case I need it later on but hmm the other thing I could do is pop it on Christmas Day and I have put a, oh I'll just cover it I don't I won't be able to reuse it, I've already stuck it down. There we go. I'll pop these, I think, at the top. I've seen quite a few people do this and it looks really cute, so. There we go. So this is my Christmas week. It will be in two seconds. There we go. There we go. Let's just centre that so you can see it properly. Right, that is my Christmas week. Oh, I do love it. I really, really love it. Can't wait to fill in these bits once, you know, we, we figure out something to do at the weekend to finish off the festivities. But other than that, I really hope that you like this video. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. But, well, until next time, I hope you have a very Merry Christmas and a very Happy New Year if you don't watch my next video. And that is it. Bye, guys.